This 17-year-old is dominating the AAU scene, racking up hundreds of thousands of followers, and is well on his way to making the NBA, all with one arm. This is Hansel Emanuel, the one-armed kid NBA players feed. See, Hansel's story starts in 2004, when he was born in Los Minas, Santo Domingo. This is one of the most dangerous slums in the Dominican Republic. And if life wasn't already hard enough, things got a whole lot worse in 2009, when Hansel was just six years old. One day after school, he was playing outside and decided to climb an old brick wall, when all of a sudden, it collapsed on his left arm leaving him trapped and helpless for over two hours. And by the time help could arrive, Hansel was unconscious and barely clinging on to life. So he was rushed to the local hospital, where doctors discovered that every nerve in his arm was completely destroyed, leaving them with only one solution, amputation. And the very next day, Hansel woke up from surgery a completely different kid. But despite his new condition, one thing remained the same, Hansel's love for the game of basketball. See, basketball was the one thing that made Hansel happy. It gave him purpose, and he fell in love with the sport so much that he told himself one day he'd make it to the NBA. Problem was, the kid sucked, and he had one arm now. Everyone in Los Mina was doubting him. So, to prove the haters wrong, Hansel started practicing his game day and night, honing his craft for over 10 years. And by 2019, 16-year-old Hansel started dominating the streetball scene. Step back threes, crossovers, windmill dunks. This kid had it all. But if Hansel was gonna make it to the NBA, he needed to get their attention first. And what better way to do that than going viral? So in 2019, he started his first Instagram account and did what any teenager would do to get clout. Go ham on the gram. Posting workout pics, highlights from his games, even flexing his new Louis belt. And by August of 2019, our boy Hansel got his first viral post. This clip went viral, being shared by Overtime and Bleacher Report. Overnight, Hansel's highlights went from hundreds of views to hundreds of thousands. This is exactly what he needed to launch himself into the mainstream. So in 2020, with people desperate to hear about Hansel's story, he was invited by the Color Vision Network for his first ever TV interview where he revealed to the world his dreams of playing in the NBA. And luckily, there was one guy watching that could help make that happen, Moises Michel. See, Moises was a longtime family friend of Hansel's, but most importantly, he had just gotten a job coaching high school basketball in Florida. So the next day, Moises reached out to Hansel and gave him a scholarship to play for the Life Christian Academy Lions. And with this, Hansel went to La Isabella International Airport and boarded the first flight to America. This was the biggest opportunity in Hansel's entire life. If he could prove himself against actual NBA prospects in America, he'd have a real shot at joining the NBA. But as soon as Hansel stepped foot in the US, he was hit with a wall of doubt, this time from his own teammates. See, in January of 2021, Hansel showed up to his first practice at Life Christian Academy. And aside from Coach Moises, no one knew who Hansel was. They just saw him as this foreign kid who only had one arm. So they overlooked Hansel, thinking he didn't have what it took to be a great basketball player. And at first, it seemed like they were right. The team was doing a drill where if a player missed a shot, they were forced to do push-ups. And Hansel missed his first layup. So the entire team thought he was done for, that he would just give up, walk off the court and go home. But instead, Hansel dropped to the floor and silenced every doubter in that gym. Two. There's you, I don't help you. And he do 20 push-ups on one hand. 
What did you think in that moment? He changed everybody with those 20 butchers. My coaches, my players, they all was like, oh, I want to be better. These 20 push-ups earned Hansel the respect of the entire Lions team. And from this day forward, he not only became the heart and soul of the Life Christian Academy, but he also started dominating on the court, averaging 26 points, 11 rebounds, 7 assists, 3 blocks, and 3 steals per game all while leading Life Christian Academy to a Florida State Championship. And with this kind of success, Hansel earned himself an even greater opportunity. He was recruited to play against NBA caliber prospects for one of the top AAU teams in the entire country, SOH Elite. So Hansel was officially one step closer to achieving his dream. And now, it was do or die. Because if he couldn't dominate on a national stage, everyone would think he just isn't skilled enough and he'd never make it to the NBA. So Hansel showed up to his very first AAU game with the weight of the world on his shoulders. And what did he do? Well... Hansel ended up scoring 12 straight points in just 40 seconds, leading the SOH Elite to a comeback victory in his first game. And from this point on, Hansel was unstoppable, performing at such a high level that just a few months later, he was selected to play in the AAU's All-Star Tournament, where the best of the best in high school basketball compete for a national championship. And it was at this point that Hansel started going mainstream. I'm talking ESPN articles, appearances on Ball's Life, shoutouts from Shaquille O'Neal, uh, the dude even had his own documentary air during halftime of the 2021 NBA Finals. And this kid's name was being echoed across the world. But uh, hold up, let's be honest for a second. Hansel's famous now, and, and that's cool, but his dream wasn't to have millions of followers. His dream was to make it to the NBA. And uh, there's just no way a one-armed kid can achieve a goal like that. Or at least, that's what Hansel was starting to believe. Because uh, despite the high school offer, the AAU recruitment, and all of his popularity, there was still one more thing he needed to continue his basketball journey and make it to the NBA. A Division I college scholarship. Because if he didn't play against college competition, scouts would never see him as NBA material. And as he looked around and saw other players throughout the country finally get their scholarship offers, Hansel had none. So it seemed like his NBA dreams were dead. Until August 12th, 2021, when Hansel got a letter in the mail that would change his life forever. It was his first Division I scholarship offer to play college basketball at Tennessee State University, guaranteeing himself a spot to play at the highest level of the NCAA. And following this D1 offer, Hansel got another life-changing opportunity, the chance to practice one-on-one -on -one with Kyrie Irving. So he's well on his way to achieving his dream of becoming the first ever one-armed player in NBA history. Damn, this kid is truly special. He's living, breathing proof that no matter who you are or what you're going through, you can achieve anything you set your mind to and do things that the world says is impossible. But our boy Hansel still got a lot to prove because his journey to the NBA is just getting started. Try to catch me howling at the moon.